Hey everybody. Today what I want to do is talk about a new workbook that I have. It's the T Neckline Workshop and it's designed to um, be a companion to the T pattern. If you already own this pattern, you know, they look like this. This is the misses and this is the women's. So I have a, a wide variety of sizes. It's got above the bust seam detail that allows you to play with stripes and bias grain lines and color block and all sorts of fun. So what I've done now to expand the versatility of this pattern is I did a workbook that has several different style necklines that allow you to get almost endless, um, you know, endless versions of this tee. I'm wearing the low crisscross with a little more coverage and the, the tee on my dress form is the low crisscross, you know, that's a little bit more of an open style. Um, so I address you know, being able to make these different styles and feel comfortable and cover your bra straps. So it's kind of a cool thing. All right, so here's the workbook. And basically what it does is it goes through step-by-step -step how to draft all the pieces. Okay, so everything is color photography. And I've also included templates of all of the new neckline designs, all the pieces, so you, you can see what they're supposed to look like can trace them and compare them to your pattern and kind of use them as a guide to make sure you're going in the right direction. But I encourage you to try drafting these yourself using your pattern pieces because it's really a lot of fun. I start the workbook showing you how to draft a master set of pieces. Then we go on to use those master set of pieces to make a V-neck, a scoop neck, a crossover bodice, which you know comes across and it's got a um, overlap section in the front. And the next one is a square neckline, the low crisscross that I have on the dress form here, and a funnel neck, which is really cool. It's like a micro turtleneck, really cozy for the cooler months. And then I totally scoop it out and get rid of the center front piece to make a tank top. So it's got a lot of different versions of, you know, a lot of different styles that you can mix and match the front and back and change it around and make all sorts of different looks with this pattern now. It's very exciting. The other really cool thing is I'll show you how to put the pieces together to make a facing so you can eliminate seams when you're finishing your neckline and armhole edges if you're making a sleeveless version. Um, so that's really cool. So that's what the workbook looks like. Let me just give you a close up of some of the um, versions of the tee. So this would be one of my favorites. It's the tank top version. And you can see that I got rid of the, um, I got rid of the um, neck, the center front piece altogether. And if you remember a few weeks ago, I did a tutorial showing how to use your dress form and your bra to measure so your straps don't show. So you can check that out. So if you're making an open style like this, you can measure your pattern to make sure that you're putting enough fabric where your straps are. So this is what the tank top looks like. And then I have a sort of a really open scoop where I've used the original side piece, this upper side piece, but then I've also um, really scooped out the center front. And then here's the funnel neck. This works really nice on rib knit. You know, it's built up into like this little kind of turtleneck, which is kind of cool. Um, you can color block that as well, you know, to make it a little more obvious, but it's kind of a cozy winter style. And then I have a square neck. That's what this looks like. And um, you can see the armhole and neckline edges are finished. You know, so that's kind of a cool thing. I show you step by step how to do that. And then I have the V-neck. Okay, so on these more open styles, you can also use bias woven fabric instead of a knit because there's so little fabric there that the stretch and the bias is enough to make these open necklines work. So it really gives you tons of ways to use the T pattern. All right, so if you're the kind of sewer that likes to just have the printed instructions in front of you, this workbook is right up your alley. If you're the kind of sewer that likes to have visual video instruction, 
it's very exciting because I've also done a new class called Beyond the Boat Neck, and that's going to be available on Pattern Review very, very soon. So you can, you know, take advantage of the video class. Um, you know, I've got this printed workbook, um, all sorts of options for you to expand the look of your tea. So if you have any questions, please post them below and I will be happy to answer. So if you want to get your copy of this workbook, you can just click on the, um, you know, look below, look below the video for all the information on ordering this workbook. It's $20. And if you have any questions or comments, please post them below. And I hope you guys have a great day and happy sewing.